Fellow dear friends, I saw this coming, that a Frankenstein monster was being created. I saw the signal. I saw the red flag. And I warned you that if something is not done about Inam de Kano, it will consume the Igbo people. And you did not listen. I took some time, more than 24 hours after the break of the news, on the dastard and cowardly attack on one of our finest and one of our best, Ike Ekoremado, who I know very well, I know very well, was one of the people who made this ingrate Enam in Dekanu to come out of prison. I am privy to most of the discussions, and I feel very sad that I was part. I participated in those meetings. Ike Okromado and Abaribe were the arrowhead that moved for the release of this ingrate in Namdekano. That Ike Kromadu will be attacked, disgraced, and is closed down for what purpose? To achieve what? If this dangerous trend is not stopped among Igbo Biafrans, where one man arrogates to himself the right to life, to give life, and to pronounce death, <laughs> you will be in fire because others will fight him. Fulani people are killing. Gambari men are killing people everywhere in Igbo land. I have not heard IPOB, cowardly IPOB raising their hand. It is to sneak in the night to go and kill fellow Igbo Biafrans. That is what they can do. It's to sneak to, to mob, mob attack fellow Igbo Biafrans. That is what they can do. Shame on all of you supporting it. I feel so ashamed. I feel so, so ashamed. I feel ashamed that I, Abale, my ancestor is an Abam man, a warrior from Abam. In Abam. My grandmother, my great grandmother, one is from Amore, the other one is from Ozakoli. I have Igbo blood flowing in my vein. I have never denied it. The same way Igbo blood is flowing in my vein. I feel so, so ashamed. What contribution did Enam the Kano father or his family gave to the Biafran liberation struggle? My is legendary. My uncle, His Majesty King Frederick Prince William Macri VIII, abdicated the sacred throne of the Kalawar people for his support for Biafra. Who is Namdi father? Who is Namdi? A warrant, an ordinary warrant chief of an autonomous community created just yesterday. My father was enlisted into the Nigerian army. Honorable Justice Melford Gooden, at that time, he was, a, he was an health worker, a community health worker in Aba. And he served under Samuel Mbakwe. If we don't rise up against this evil and send this miscreant out of our house, they will set our house on fire. This is the time to kick them out of the house before they set the house on fire.